The Walker County Commission is working with the state leaders to figure out a solution to a growing concern, the lack of election poll workers. House Bill 185 would allow those commissioners to have the option to combine voting precincts to form voting centers if needed. ABC 3340's Bobby Portovan talked with Walker County election officials as well as a poll worker. Bobby, what's the reason for the lack of poll workers we're seeing? Stephen, I'm told there's a few reasons behind this. Walker County election officials tell me the main reason is that when poll workers retire, there's not enough people coming in behind them to fill those positions. Now, a mayor in Walker County is stepping up to the plate to help. Nauvoo's 71-year-old mayor, Terry Burgett, recently became a poll worker for the very first time. Probate judge for Walker County, Lee Tucker, called me and asked me if I'd like to be a poll worker, and he had a vacancy in Nauvoo. And since I was the new mayor, it gave me a chance to see some of the people that I had not met, and I agreed to do it. He believes others should do the same, especially younger people. The future, if we don't get more poll workers, they're going to combine some of the polls, which means longer lines, which means some people might not want to vote. Alabama Representative Matt Woods from Walker County is sponsoring House Bill 185. If passed, it would give the Walker County Commission the ability to combine precincts to form voting centers if they ever needed to do so because there wasn't enough poll workers for elections. Walker County probate judge and the county's chief election official, Lee Tucker, says the county saw a 30 percent drop in poll workers from 2020 to 2022. Probably the the pandemic that we had during over the last last two years had an effect on it and also it's the uh, the, the average age of the poll workers is increasing so you, you have some natural reduction in folks that want to work due to their age or, or illness or, and we we're trying to recruit more uh, younger folks to come in and also we're looking to how we can maximize the numbers that we do have. For Burgett being a poll worker is a no-brainer. I need to help out the community and if they're having trouble getting poll workers if I do it then that means that's one less they have to look to find. Now, House Bill 185 was only introduced at the State House a few weeks ago on March 22nd, but so it's still pretty early on at the State House, but we're continuing to follow its progress. Stephen. Bobby Portovent reporting.